dumb but is here to entertain you. Hey, Zansi. There is so much sometimes that we do and we don't know the gravity of what is being done. Sometimes I just blame all of this to illiteracy and lack of common sense because everything keeps getting some sort of way and I'm like, what is going on? Like, where are we heading to? In what generation are we? Guys, in today's video, there is this grave digger who is seriously on the fire after sharing a video of an empty AKA grave already during the setup and Mzansi has been fuming and getting so disappointed at why on earth will he go as far as do such a thing. Make sure you watch this video right up to the end so that you get to understand the whole narrative. Before that, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, please. Like this video, drop a comment and hit onto my post notification bell. AKA's family wanted a private funeral to lay to rest. The well known South African rapper aka Forbes Kiernan whose life was claimed sometime in Durban. The grave digger is seriously on the fire after sharing a video of aka MT's grave during the setup. South Africans noticed that the man is not South African as well and of course he was speaking I think a Malawian language if I am not mistaken at where is actually considered to be aka's graveyard. It is very unfortunate that all of these things have to be happening in such a way and still unfortunately guys I really can't show you all the video because I I really feel like it's for me right it's not appropriate it's not appropriate at all to do such a thing but I think it's just a disparity of culture and by the way I don't even hear what he's saying so I really don't know what he was actually even saying probably he was doing it for a just cause but I think uh, South Africans don't just want that to happen like why on earth are you going to be showing that kind of a thing to the entire world to the public I mean if not for publicity stunts, then what next are you actually looking for, according to what several people were thinking. Guys, let's actually get into how I came across this post. And on Twitter, I saw this Charles Banks who says, Shocking. Grave digger on the fire for recording aka empty grave during the setup for the Slain Superstar and posting it on TikTok. Okay, some of the comments really got me and the one reads, uh, this is what happens when you have people who do not share your values, beliefs and customs and have them occupy roles that locals can do. Then another says, did you understand what he is saying? He's probably saying a prayer. So, Brody is a beneficiary of friendship level. No wonder we will never close our bodies. This is so unprofessional. You would think this Brody Funeral Palo has a code of conduct for their employees. This guy did nothing, Nina. We're posting pictures of a minor grieving. Noun, you wanna be high and mighty? There is pictures of Cairo crying. There's videos of AKA being shared doing the rounds. How insensitive and disrespectful was that? I don't understand the language, but I don't think this guy meant any harm or disrespect. I think he was just excited of being part of the Super Megas burial, that's all. Yes, that's all about he is speaking Shishewa. Bringing Brody into this into disrepute serves them right for exploiting cheap migrant labor. They needed to fix this mess. He was marketing his business. He did the right way decor and grave digging. If you want to die, you can talk to him and he will bury you. You will do that on weddings when you supply chairs. The people complaining about this post are the same people who were sharing the videos of when he got shot. It's really not the it's really not that deep, or is it because the guy is a foreigner? Guys, I mean, there is just so much that has been said already about uh, this particular guy who shared this video, yo. And uh, Zanzi, it's I understand that it's a very difficult moment right now. So please, let's try to take things calmly. And uh, guys, tell me in the comment section what you think about all of what is going on.